Huh? I, I, I guess. <laughs> oh, y'all recording? Oh, hey. I got you. I'm just brushing my hair. I'm just brushing my hair. You know what I mean? I ain't doing that. Okay, now I'm just joking, which I did it on purpose. <laughs> you know, we, we love to have fun here on the Living Room Network. We love to have fun. That's that's what personal development and growth should be all about. It should be about having fun while you cultivate yourself. You know, not being all serious and just stuck and just uptight, hasa diddy, acting all bougie like you're better than everybody. That's not the way to go, Joe Smo. So, with that being said... I got some interesting stuff I want to let you know about the secret of life. I'm definitely making up from yesterday. Yesterday I supposed to have made a video, but um, it wasn't on my mind. So uh, yeah, now today is on my mind, and I'm definitely going to make up for it. You can best believe that. So what do we start off by saying here on the Living Room Network? That's right. Divine powers are always working for us because we're trying to do the right thing. Thing. That's right. That's what we believe here. We believe divine powers are working for us because we're always trying to do the right thing in life. That's 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 what we want to do. All right. So um, if you haven't already, went go to the website www.deliveryroom.org. Get familiar with that site. I'm gonna be updating it periodically. Uh, hopefully month by month if I get the time. Um, if not month by month, definitely gonna be week by week. I was gonna say year by year. <laughs> But anyway, um, yeah, go to the website, get familiar, and also subscribe. I'm making more videos every single day, and they usually pertain to these type of topics, you know, the deep thinking, critical, spiritual, metaphysic type topics, you know, things to help you grow and become a better person, become your greatest, greatest version, become a light, and it's good stuff, guys. It's, it's good stuff. It's positive energy. It makes you radiate, makes you glow more. You know, and people can see the difference in you, you know, when you start to learn more about who it is that you are as a person rather than putting your focus on everybody else around you when they don't do nothing for you. So let's come back to ourselves and let's do a little simple meditation prayer technique right now. Okay, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. This is prayer and meditation. Because what we're doing is we're calming down our spirit, our soul. See how I was when I entered the video? It's the same way our days are every single day. Chaotic, hectic, full of activity, work, play. No rest, no relaxation, not enough time to look at our inner selves. So, if you watch more of my videos, I want to get you in the habit of understanding how to relax, meditate, and pray. We're praying that our body comes to a complete bliss of calmness and peace. Okay, let's continue. It feels good. It feels good to be new again. See, you become new that quick when you pray and when you meditate. So pray on things more. Pray pray for whatever you want to happen in your life. Do it just like that. Calm yourself down. Go inside your mind and tell yourself and which itself connects to the universe and God, God's creation around you. It tells that what you want and just continue to do that and believe in it. And it'll happen for you because you're a God, you know? So... I got another secret. The secret of life. The secret of life. This is just an insight. Um, I had an insight today about the secret of life. Um, and the big secret is, the big secret is, the secret is, life works for you. We are rolling. Oh, my God. We are rolling now. We we rolling. Life works for you guys. I guarantee you when we all die and we go to wherever we got to go, heaven, and we get there, and the creator of the universe says, you know what? Did you know the whole time you were there, 
I'm gonna show. I'm gonna. I'm gonna let you go watch the TV, and I'm gonna let you watch your life, and I'm gonna show you how much times I was there for you, and you didn't even realize how much I was working for you, and you sit there, you watch this video about your life, and you say, "Dang, the whole time it was working for me." Are you serious? Oh my God! Oh my freaking God! I could have had that girl. I could have had that boyfriend. Oh my God! Are you freaking serious, God? Are you freaking serious? And I guarantee you guys, that's 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 the truth. That's the truth. Like about life, the truth about life is, it really works for you. Don't tell nobody this. Keep it to yourself. Keep it to yourself. Keep it. Tell them they gotta come watch a video in order to know this information. Anyway, and that's why you share it. Uh, anyway, um, the secret of life is it works for you. You know, have you ever noticed that things happen when you least expect them to happen? It's like the it's like the universe, the creation saying it's like the creation which forms everything that happens to you. The creation does that. It's like the creation saying, stop thinking so much. Stop stressing so much. Cast your care upon me. Cast your worries upon me. Stop thinking so freaking hard, people. Because all this thinking and all this inside voices going on in your head is confusing me about what it is that you want. You say you want something. Then you turn around and say, I don't even think I can get it. You know, and, 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 and the universe is like, what the, what do you want? I ain't about to deliver this in UPS and, you know, they send it right back to me. I ain't about to sit here and build this big, this big prize for this person and, and they going to send it right back to me. If that ain't what they really want. Because when you ask for something, you ask for it, right? You ask for it, right? Hey, I want this. Uh, yeah, I want a new car and I want it to be blue and I want the interior leather and I want a, a CD player in it. And, you know what I'm saying? Okay. It heard your prayer. You was praying. Okay? So what do you do? Nine times out of ten, what you gonna do? You gonna go next day, come. Do 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 you just walk and have a good time. Do 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 your friend see, hey Reggie, Reggie, what's up, man? What's up? Nothing, man. Chilling, man. Reggie say, Hey, what about that new car, man? You tell me some more about that new car. You tell Reggie, you say, Ah oh, man, I don't even think I ain't even got I ain't even getting no overtime at work, man. I I can't get no overtime to get the car. I'm going to get the car. Me, me. Reggie say, man, you get the car, man. Don't worry about that. You can get the car. You get Reggie, you don't know, but God is working through Reggie. The universe, the creation around us, that energy is resonating through Reggie to talk to you and tell you the truth about what you pray. Reggie say, man, you can get that car, man. Forget that. Forget the job. I don't even know why you there anyway. You should quit the job. You like, then this is what you like. You like, nah, man, I'm... I need that overtime. That's the only way I can get the car. You just literally killed the whole prayer right there. You just literally told the creation of God, the universe, you just literally told your prayer, you can't get it anymore. You can't get the car that you prayed for because you're not getting overtime at work. So what's the thing going to happen? You ain't going to get the car. You're not going to get the car. You're not going to get the means to get the car at all. You're not going to get overtime. You know, you don't already think you don't, you're not going to get overtime. You're not going to get no overtime. That's one. And two, you're not going to get the car, you know? And it's just a bad day for Reggie and you. <laughs> that was a good example, guys. I hope you, I hope you understood that. Um, but yeah, that the secret of life is that life works for us. Um, that's why it is so good to meditate and clear your thoughts and relax your mind. Um, the less chatter it is, the more you can tune yourself into that still small voice. And that still small voice is the only voice that you need to hear. And that is the only voice that you began with in the very beginning. Um, not until you grew up and you know became older and you let everybody else's suggestions which are good and you know so opinions which are good but you let their whole suggestion and their whole opinion infiltrate your mind without filtering out the things that you did not want and so 
after watching TV, after reading that magazine and listening to that cassette tape about how it is that you should live your life, you've taken in every single word that you could possibly take and your mind is overcapacitated when you should have only just filtered out all the stuff that you don't need, that you don't like, that does not resonate with you. And you should have just ran with that. If you would have ran with that, you will still be in balance with the things that you want and learning at the same time. That is the proper way to learn. You know, that's the proper way to learn. The proper way to learn is to take that which ye want keep it for ye self that which is not good for ye which may be good for somebody else keep it over there save some for the rest of the people don't eat the whole pie if you eat the whole pie you get an upset stomach if you eat a whole box of cereal in one day i hope you're not lactose tolerant because we know what will happen if that is the case <laughs> so um yeah you get the point guys so you take in a little day by day. You know, you don't overcapacitate yourself. You don't go long right away. You just relax, come at peace. Hear the still small voice, the secret of life. That's the secret of life, knowing that it already, already should be working for you. It is working for you. That's what it, that's why, look, when you, when you, when we talk about space and stuff like that, that crazy stuff that's out of this world, you know, you know how people talk to you. You ain't talking about that crazy stuff again, stars and the moon again. When we talk about space and we go look at reports on NASA and we, you know, look at our science books and we see the stars in the sky and stuff, you got to ask yourself. How is it that this stuff is perfectly, um, like, moving about each other? Like, these planets are lined up, and it's a circle, and it's a circle within a circle, and there's another circle within a circle, and every day the sun comes up in our world, and it goes back down, and the moon comes up, and it goes back down every day. You know, every day everything is so perfect, and it keeps rotating around and around and around again. All this perfection, but an asteroid never hits us, knocks us out of the cosmos, you know, nothing, a, a great big hole through the earth has not happened yet. I mean, we're just rotating, we're just here, and it's just so perfect. How is it that this stuff that we don't have no control over is able to function in an orderly fashion? Hmm. Well, let's look at your life. Shouldn't your life function in an orderly fashion, too? If you know that, if you believe that, do you receive that? I hope you receive that. All right. All right, now, I believe you now. All right, I got you, I got you, I got you. I hope you agree with me now. If you agree with me now, I'm believing in you. All right? All right, now. I'm trying to send this in you on the Living Room Network. Thank you for watching. Also, please subscribe. And also leave a comment below because if you don't make, let your voice be known, nobody's going to know who you are if we're alike. You know, if we're like-minded people here on the Living Room Network, make your voice be known. I like to talk to people. I like to meet gods. Ye are gods, you know. I like to meet people and and see where they can help. You know, they can help me in my life, and maybe I can help you in your life. So let your voice be known so somebody else can even see you. And that's how you make connections in life. That's how you get from point A to point B. That's how you're able to make a big trip from California to North Carolina, New York to Florida. You know, let's go intercontinental. China, Spain, Africa, you know, you can get friends that's like-minded, y'all connect, y'all get together, and y'all make things shape. I'm going to make something shape. Thank you for watching this video. It's Trinity Sentence, and you're on the Living Room.